And we start at 5.30 with the evening rush, a recap of today's top stories from 5 o'clock. For the first time since June, Governor Gretchen Whitmer held a COVID-19 briefing today. She was joined by top health officials in Grand Rapids this morning. The governor pleaded with residents to take this pandemic seriously to stop the spread, including calling on the unvaccinated to get the COVID-19 vaccine and those who have been vaccinated to get their booster shots as soon as possible. The governor says she does not plan to shut down the state again or enforce mask mandates. And the Kellogg's strike is officially over. Union members voted to approve the recommended contract, putting an end to that strike that began October 5th. The new contract includes a number of gains, including a clear path to regular full-time employment, a moratorium on plant shutdowns for the next five years, and the maintenance of cost of living raises. And the man police believe shot and killed a man at my bar in Norton Shores has been arrested. Kyle Robbins turned himself in early this morning, ending a five day search. The Muskegon County prosecutor has charged Robbins with open murder and felony firearm charges in connection to the death of Andre Carter last Thursday. Robbins is in the Muskegon County Jail. And that is your evening rush.